what is going on everybody this is G here with another video and today guys i want to do another tutorial with you guys so in this tutorial we're going to be building a semi truck over there this that semi truck and the materials we're going to be needing are these we're going to be needing the wheels the windows the color of your truck you need a stone slab or you can use cobblestone i prefer using stone a uh, blue and the blue and the carpet. Those are what color you want your actual um, cab of your truck. You want, you want it to be. Then you're gonna need these, this stuff for the back. Okay. So guys, let's get into so the. So guys, to start this, you guys are gonna want to take your wheels and place one wheel there. This is gonna be the front. One wheel there, and then go across three and place another. And then you're gonna gonna count five blocks this way. One, two, three, four, five. And you're gonna place two blocks like that. There you go. Now you got the wheels in your truck. And now what you're going to want to do is take your stone slabs. And you're going to want to bring this out to like this. And then like that. Right there. And there you go. Now you got your front bumper of your truck. Then what you guys are going to want to do is you're going to want to go back two back here. Two back there. And fill this all in like this. And then go back two like this and dent one in. And then on back out here, you're gonna want out again. Okay. And then in the back, you're gonna want to go out one out here. Just so it all encloses it. So guys, for the next part of this truck, you guys are gonna want to take your color of your cat that you're gonna be making, place it like this, like an L shape, leaving the corners like that, and then take your stone slabs. Place it like that, and then you're gonna want to fill that in and place stone slabs like that. There you go, now you got that. And now, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to put that into one, and then this goes around, go around like that, so you got a little area in there, and then bring this up like that, and then up one more. So that goes three up, and then across down here, and then you got this little area there. Now, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to take your black stained glass paint, so I'm gonna use black stain. Because it, it makes it just add some color and it gives it a little bit privacy. So you're going to want to do that for the front windshield. Then you're going to want a white stained glass. And white stained glass. Those are going to be the mirrors. And also, guys, I did forget you guys are going to need string. You guys are just going to need three, three string pins. Place that like that. Sorry, guys. But yeah, you guys are going to need all that. And then just place your. There you guys have. You guys can keep it like this, or you guys can go the no string way. You guys can do it like that, or you can go the uh, no string way and do like that. So it's it, it it's preferable. I like this way. So you guys can do it either way. And now we're gonna go on the back. So what you guys are gonna need to do for the back here is gonna grab anvil and all that all the rest of this stuff. So place the anvil there and then surround it like that. And then bring this like Cover that the rest like this, like I'm doing, and then cover the rest just like that. There you guys have it. Now you guys got the back of your truck all done. So when you guys when you want to pull anything in and you want to hook it up, there you guys. There you guys have it. So then you guys are gonna want to do. You guys could have done this before, but I forgot. You're gonna want to get buttons and place all your buttons down like this. Thing that hooks actually 
guys are gonna want to do it. So you want to keep going out. You guys can go out as many blocks as you want. But no, you're gonna want to go out. So now you can kind of see it's kind of taking shape right now. So then, now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to grab your quartz slabs and just cover the entire roof with quartz slabs. Again, this will look better if it's quartz, but I like to use wool because it looks better. But if you don't like the look, change it to quartz. And it might just go go together a little bit better, but I just need to look for it. So I'm just going to want to fill it in. And there you go. Now you guys have to. Now you're going to want to grab your stone slab. Your stone slab. And you're going to want to go down here. And you could have done this before. So guys, if you guys wanted to do something 
I did, uh, like a little logo on it. What I suggest is just break blocks and fill them in with just uh, red wool and stuff. They actually look, they actually start to look pretty good. See guys? Now it looks kind of like you have some kind of logo on there. See? So yeah. And now, I'm going to do a Guys, I also have another trick for you. If you guys want to do like, if you want to have it open, if you want to have it like if a slight open door, you can do it like that. Have it so like it looks like people are actually filling it up and stuff. Or you can have it so like it's in one of those pull down doors. So just it just adds that little bit of detail to it. I'm gonna keep mine like this because I like it like that. If you guys also if you guys wanted to do any like packages or anything. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.